Hello everybody, Carolina Tony. Welcome to my channel. If you're here for the first time, be sure to go down here, click subscribe, and after you subscribe, be sure to ring the bell so you'll be notified every time we put a video out. Today we are in Wilson, North Carolina at Follis Sepsis Whirly Gig Park, where in 1985 he retired and started building Whirly Gigs. And we're going to look at that. But right after this station, identification. We are in Wilson, North Carolina at Whirly Gig Park. And Vala Simpson, his farm was out on the edge of town about 11 miles from Wilson. In the 1980s, they referred to it as Acid Park because the sculptures would reflect car headlights after dark. This is way out in the countryside. This is the original place of Vala Simpson's Whirly Gig Park. Looks like perhaps this might have been his shop. So he started at retirement age making these Whirly Gigs and he made them up until he was 94 years old. He passed away in 2013. And this was his shop as you can look through there. started taking some of this farm machinery and turning it into art. There, some of the Whirly Gigs. No creation is greater than its creator. Now you have gone home to yours. We miss you, Mr. Fallis. Some more down in there. January the 17th, 1919, Vala Simpson was born, and in 1941, he went into the U.S. Army Air Corps, where he served in World War II in the Pacific. He was start discharged in November the 26, 1945, as a staff sergeant. And he got married in 47, and he had two sons and a daughter. But in 1985, he retired and started creating whirly gigs. And the neat thing about all of this is in 1996, he was commissioned to make four sculptures for the Olympics in Atlanta, Georgia. And in 2010, the citizens of Wilson decided, hey, all these whirly gigs way out in the country, they need to be brought down to the city so everybody can see them. So they put together a commission to start working on that. In 2012, Mr. Simpson was named Hero of the New South in Southern Living Magazine. June 2013, his Whirly Gigs were designated as official folk art of the state of North Carolina. In 2011, he even wins the North Carolina Award, and in 2013, he passed away at age 94. And this park 
they broke ground in 2013 shortly after he died and the park opened up with all these whirly gigs that he had built over his lifetime in 2017 and this is what we've got now and these things are awesome Feel a good breeze coming up and it's getting faster and faster. Well, if I say so myself, this place is pretty cool. Never even seen a whirly gig bigger than the size of your hand. And these things are monsters. It's a good windy day today. These things are going like crazy. Hope you've enjoyed our trip to Wilson to the Follow Simpsons Whirly Gig Park. It's listed in all kinds of magazines and roadsides of America. And I'd have to say this is a pretty cool roadside attraction. Hope you've enjoyed it. But for now, y'all have a good day. <laughs>